My favorite color has always been yellow. Bright, hopeful, and full of energy. Coincidentally, yellow also represents endometriosis awareness. So today I want to talk to you about something that's a bit close to my heart. Pain and endometriosis, but not from a purely surgical point of view, which I usually do. This time I want to touch upon a different aspect that's often invisible. Now, just like peeling this orange, when I go inside a woman's abdomen during surgery, I can carefully remove what I can see. I can remove endometriotic lesions, we can have a look at pelvic congestion, we can have a look at adenomyosis, and even at times diagnose tight pelvic floor muscles. Now, all these are direct causes of pain, and I make sure each of them are treated completely. But sometimes, even after a perfect surgery, some women continue to feel pain. And that's when we start thinking about something that we can't see, what's not over here. And that's called central sensitization. Now, in simple words, central sensitization is when the nervous system becomes a bit extra sensitive. The body learns pain so deeply that the brain starts to amplify it even when the original trigger, say endometriosis or other causes, is gone. It's as if your body's pain alarm is stuck on high volume. So if the pain continues after surgery, it doesn't mean always that something is missed. Sometimes the pain comes from the nerves and how the brain has adapted over a period of time. The good news, this kind of pain can improve too, but it often needs a team approach, what I like to call a multidisciplinary team. It contains a physiotherapist, a pain specialist, mindfulness, and the time for the nervous system to reset. I've written a bit more about central sensitization in the blog below, so feel free to have a read if you'd like to understand it a bit better. And now, if you'll excuse me, I need to go and find my daughter. School holidays, as you know, are in full swing over here. Remember, whether you're a surgeon or a patient, it is so important to pause and take breaks and let yourself reset because this beautiful journey called life is not just about surviving, it's about growing a little bit more each day.